Welcome to the Blossom TMS Motor Hotspot Localization Guide. In this video, we'll walk through the steps to find the optimal stimulation site for motor threshold determination. Begin by having the patient sit comfortably and upright. Next, gently place the therapy cap on the patient's head, ensuring it sits snugly but without discomfort. Make sure the cap's arrow points straight down the nose's midline. Measure two centimeters from the nation to the bottom of the cap to secure forward and back placement. Next, we need to find CZ, or central zero, the anatomical center point of the scalp. To begin, locate the inion, the bony bump at the lower back of the skull. Use your fingers to gently feel along the midline at the base of the skull until you find the most prominent point, this is the inion. Now find the nation, the indentation just above the bridge of the nose, between the eyes. Measure the distance from the nation to the inion in a straight line over the top of the scalp. Once you have the total length, divide that measurement in half. Mark the midpoint directly on the scalp. This is the mid-sagittal line halfway point and one axis for identifying CZ. Next, we'll do the same thing this time measuring from ear to ear. Identify the tragus, specifically the point at the bottom of the ear canal opening on each side. Measure the distance from this point on one ear to the same point on the other, going over the top of the head. Divide that measurement in half and mark the midpoint. This gives us the side-to-side -side midpoint which will intersect with the front-to-back line to define the CZ. Next, we're ready to define our motor hotspot search area. Start by measuring five centimeters laterally from the CZ on the left hemisphere. From there, move one centimeter upward. Then measure six centimeters forward at a 45 degree angle. This is the length from the center of the coil to its edge. The pulse comes from the center but since we can't see that, we use the coil's edge as a visual guide. We'll use this point to form a nine-point grid, moving in one centimeter increments in all directions. This grid is where we'll deliver single pulses to identify the optimal motor hotspot. Now we're ready to begin delivering single pulses. Set the device to the MTD protocol. And start at 50% intensity. Make sure the patient's right arm is relaxed with their thumb and index finger gently touching. Deliver pulses within the newly marked nine point grid and watch closely for small twitches in the thumb or index finger. Once you see a consistent twitch, you've located the motor hotspot. Mark that spot clearly.
Next, we'll determine the motor threshold, the lowest intensity that causes a visible twitch 50% of the time. Adjust the intensity up or down in 5% increments until you find the level where twitches occur in 4 out of 8 or 5 out of 10 pulses. That's your motor threshold. Once you find it, be sure to write it down immediately. Next, we'll identify the therapy spot. Starting at the motor hotspot, measure 5 centimeters straight forward. staying in line with the scalp's midline axis. This point becomes your therapy spot where treatment stimulation will be delivered. The final step is to align the coil at a 45 degree angle over the therapy spot. Once the coil is in position, mark both the therapy spot and the edge of the coil to lock in the correct angle. Remember, the pulse comes from the center of the coil, but since we can't see that, we rely on the coil's edge for consistent positioning. By marking the edge, we ensure the same angle and placement can be repeated for each treatment session.